What is autism? Well, autism is mostly a developmental disorder characterized by many different types of symptoms, including poor eye contact, where you have a hard time looking at the person. Um, it also includes a lack of communication skills. It also includes repetitive behavior, like people with severe autism, they bang their, you know, head against the wall, or they repeat stuff, you know, like, like repeating the word apple, 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 various different times. But, you know, as a guy who has a mild form of autism and looking at how many different people have the same thing that I have, you know, I see autism now as not this, you know, but rather this. Um, a couple of months ago, I went to Las Vegas um, with my dad and we went to go visit his, um, his parents. And we were out there and we were mostly out there because I turned 21 and we wanted to go out there and have a good time. Um, but while I was out there, um, my dad's parents gave me some gifts for my 21st birthday. And one of the gifts that they gave me was this sweatshirt. And it's, it's seriously possibly one of the best gifts that they have ever gave me. You know, autism. It's not a disability. It's a different ability. This message that I have on my shirt right now is absolutely true. Autism, yes, it is a developmental disorder. That is not a lie. But in back in the past and sometimes nowadays, I see people who try to represent autism and what they feel it means. There are some people out there who you know, who despise autism because they hate it. Or I see people who have like, oh, I have like cures for autism. Like there's this thing called a gluten-free diet, which is supposed to cure autism. Like what the heck is that, you know? And then I see, you know, treatments with autism and, you know, it helps improve it. But then there's the side effects for later on. Um... And yeah, you know, there's lots of, I've seen lots of stuff where how people represent autism. Some, I will say, do a great job in presenting it and they present it in the most positive way that they can. But there's also certain other people who may not know what autism is and sometimes they will misinterpret, you know, the information and mix it up a little bit and it'll make, you know, people, especially parents who have kids with autism, very angry, you know, but, but people, I want to be honest with you. What I'm trying to say in this video is don't ever feel that having autism or having any developmental disorder like autism, don't ever feel like having this disorder is a burden. Having autism can also be something unique. For example, um, there are certain subjects that I personally like. Some of them include English, reading books, making videos like I'm doing right now. Um, 
playing, oh, sorry, behind the mirror, you know, playing the drums. Um, subjects like that. But then there's subjects that I personally don't like, like math. I think math is boring. Um, science, I think it's boring. Subjects like that, you know, like there are certain subjects that I like, and then there's the other subjects where I'm like, ah, I don't really like it. Um, but it can also be unique because, you know, when you like a certain subject, you will, you share knowledge that maybe a lot of, 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 you know, other people don't understand. For example, like, and I don't want to brag here. Um, I know a lot of information about my, one of my all time favorite bands, which is the Beatles. I told people lots of facts about the Beatles sometimes, including my family. And I remember getting a few reactions where people are like, wow, you know, like, I didn't know about that. You know, that's very cool. And some people are like, how does this kid know this knowledge, you know? Well, it's because I like the Beatles and that's one of, you know, the repetitive behaviors, you know, like I like that subject. And it's a subject that's never gonna change and it's something that that's always gonna stay with me for the rest of my life. Just like autism. There's no cure for autism. I can't like write a thing where it says like, oh, like I wish I don't have autism or I can't go back in the past saying like, oh, like I don't wanna have autism. This disorder is gonna be with me for the rest of my life, people. It is a disorder where, again, I wish, personally, like, I will admit, you know, there are certain, 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 certain um, subjects that I can go on about saying like, oh, what I like about having autism and what I don't like having about autism. You know, like, there's a lot of things, like, again, I, there's, there's certain things I like about having autism, and then there's, you know, certain things I don't like having having about autism. But, um, I just saw, I just saw something weird, I'm sorry. Um, but, what I'm trying to say, people, is don't think of autism as, don't think of it as this, you know disability like uh, like sure it is a developmental disorder but it should never ever be represented as this it should be represented as this having autism can be very challenging trust me i've had my own struggles and i had my own challenges regards into having this disorder but at the same time, I'm also very thankful that I have autism because, you know, there are certain things that make me unique and there are certain things out there where I'm thankful that I have it and there's other things where I'm like, I really wish I don't have it, but... But anyways, people, um, never ever feel like having this disorder is a burden because... You should really be thankful for who you are and you should be extremely thankful for how you present it. And um, yeah, that is it guys. That's gonna be it for this video. Um, thank you guys for watching. I never really have went into a subject about autism and all that. But yeah, um, judging by the title of this video, um, Yes, I do have autism. Um, it is something that is going to be with me for the rest of my life. And um, again, I hope that by watching this video, you guys will have a different understanding of where I come from and what makes me, you know, different. Um, also, in the link in the description down below, there is a website called Autism Speaks. And it is the largest... Um, yeah, Autism Speaks is an amazing website. It's possibly 
one of the big websites where they really go like in depth on what autism is all about. They do autism research, they give details of what autism is about, and it is a really cool website that I, re that I highly recommend you guys go um, and check out. Um, again, it is Autism Speaks. I'll put the link in the description down below. Um, this is not sponsored by Autism Speaks, obviously, but um, but yeah, the, it's something you guys should really go check out. So go to Autism Speaks. The link is in the description down below. Um, if you want to learn about, if you want to learn more about autism and some of the things I talked about in this video. And with that, guys, that's gonna be a wrap. Um, thank you guys for watching, and to all of the autistic people out there, um, happy National Autism Awareness Day. And before I go, I also want to send out this message. Please, 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 people. Autism is something that people really need to share more about. Like, sure, there's a lot of things about autism out there, but if we can spread awareness about this disorder, trust me, it will literally will will have a positive impact in the world we live in. Because again, there are so many misrepresentations about this disorder that really, really should be cleared up. You know, because I've heard so many stories about autism and all that. And, um, and again, I hope that by watching this video, you'll have a more understanding of what autism is and I hope that also by watching this video you kind of understand where I come from and because I know there may be some of you out there who are like why is he so different or why doesn't he look at the camera all the time think about those facts people all right guys thank you guys for watching um social media is in this Social media is in the description down below. And for me, Ryan Boyd, thank you guys for watching. Stay gold, my friends. And I'll talk to you all very soon. Have an awesome day, everybody. Love you all. And again, don't forget, autism is not a disability, but it's a different ability. Bye, guys.